Welcome to Efox number one stop to entertainment and trending news. The brother of Wandere, known as CEO Dida, shared some disheartening messages to his followers. He revealed that his brother was recuperating, but he did not know that his kids had already passed away. Dida, who was heartbroken, has noted that he could not find the courage to tell his sibling that his children were no more. The wife to Rogers and Derek, Christine Karimi, had allegedly killed her two children and stabbed her husband thrice before attempting to take her own life. Neighbors had shared that the couple have been having wrangles. On Thursday, June 9th, and Derek reportedly arrived at their home along Masai Lodge Road late at night, leading to an argument. Karimi said to have stabbed him thrice and he sought help from neighbors who rushed him to a nearby hospital. The woman reportedly locked herself in the house and stabbed her two children six-year-old Amani Otieno and her two-year-old brother Tyrell Agogo. She then turned the knife on herself. Neighbors broke the door but it was too late to save the children and the couple are currently admitted at the Kenyatta National Hospital. As mentioned earlier, CEO Dida put out that his brother does not know that his children had passed away. He was rushed to hospital and at that time he did not know what had already happened. And so CEO Dida had shared Mungu nipe tungu vuyani a ntambia nini Yangu anaulizia watoto wake Mungu. CEO Dida also shared kindly anyone that watched Citizen News today or watched it on YouTube. And if you happen to know my bro, please don't reach out to him as he doesn't know his kids were brutally murdered yet. He's not in a condition to handle such kind of news at the moment. We would like as his family to break the news to him first when he's stable and out of danger. He also shared he nimzito Mungu ni saidie. Ama dunia ifunguke inimeze. I can't even walk into his ward because he keeps asking me to call so he can talk with his kids. Eh, mungu, him tihani ningumu nisaidie akihi. From what you have gotten to hear and see, he is a man that really loves his children. There are some videos that you can find across social media of him laughing and playing with his little boy. And his son would burst into laughter. You can only imagine how sad and devastating it will be for him to learn that those children are no more. Like the brother has shared, they wish that they will be the ones to break that news to him before anyone else. What they are waiting for is that he is in stable condition before they break that news to him. Like I mentioned in the previous video, the school where his daughter was studying, Olerai Primary School, they are standing with the family. They already have a pay bill with account Tamara Atino Fund where they are channeling contributions to help the family with any arrangement during this trying time. We continue to send our deepest condolences to the family and friends who are mourning the loss of these two beautiful children. We're up to date. Thanks so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't for these more updates. Hit on notification bell so you'll be the first to be notified once you have any new uploads. I'll catch you on the next one. Bye-bye.